What it do, what it do, K-Boss here. And I hope you doing superb. <laughs> what are we going over to here? What are we doing here? In about nine hours, people. Uh, this is for the alliance of the Greek gods. I became leader. Uh, which, you know, I don't really get uh, Titles don't mean nothing to me. I'm, I'm here for the gameplay. Anyway. Um, what's very important is to find out what the hell is going on. Damn. And so, the Shadow Legion invasion, for the sake of our people, we must hold them back. So it says, defend your cities from invading Shadow Legion troops. Requirements must be in an alliance to take part in this event uh, your alliance must have at least 30 people to take part in this event. Uh, starting the event, uh, your alliance leader or officers can choose to uh, activate these events. Okay, so I'm, this is pretty much similar to most other things that I've done. So basically all they're going to do is they're going to attack our bases based off of when we hit that notification. So... Um, so it says, one t uh, each time this event occurs, your alliance can only activate it one time. Each governor can only send one troop to attack the Shadow Legion. So it says, how to play. During this event, a large number of dark, for uh, dark fortresses will appear on the map. Once the event has been activated, the Dark Fortresses will send out Shadow Legion troops to attack Alliance member city in the same province as the Dark Fortress. So basically, you can't shield up. So don't worry about it. So there's going to be 25 waves of attacks. So make sure you have your troops inside and they're not gathering. So one of the things that I will say is very important in this particular situation, which I've been through many of other games do the same thing, is you can reinforce your allies. So make sure you're huddled next to somebody that's smaller than you, so that way you can get additional points. And then the more points that you get, the better we do as an alliance, pretty much is what I, I would think would happen. So it says uh, you will be eliminated from the event if your city is breached. So make sure you put your best heroes on your wall and make sure the wall and your towers are upgraded. I'll go over that here in a second. So um, once you have been eliminated, the Shadow Legions will, not, uh, will no longer attack your city. However, in this case, you can send your troops to help people who are still active. So if you are on during the time that it's set, which, when I said it, I will put out a message on the Alliance, uh, I don't know, message board. No, I'll probably send out a message. That's probably what I'm going to do. I'm going to send out a message and put it on the Alliance board and send it out in Alliance chat. So that way you know to stay tuned. And I want to get as many people on as possible so we can do very well at this event. Um, it says, to complete the event, you must survive all 25 waves without being breached twice. The event will end if all Alliance members have been eliminated. Uh, event difficulties and points. Before activating the event, your Alliance leader or officers can select a difficulty level from the event page. Which I'm probably going to start with the smallest one since we do, we're, we're just starting out so we're not large enough to do anything major but i'm pretty sure the higher the difficulty level it's going to be more points so it says unlock so we probably won't even get to start with the except for the basic anyway it looks like so it says to unlock a new difficulty level your alliance must complete the previous difficulty level with in with excuse me previous difficulty level with at least 15 surviving Alliance members. One, uh, your Alliance will be able to select a new difficulty level in the next instance 
of that event. So that makes sense. Defeating Shadow Legion troops will earn your individual points and alliance points. That's what I was talking about. So make sure that you have your best heroes for the wall. And I'll go over how to look that up and uh, what you should be doing to upgrade them. And it says, about the Shadow uh, Legion, uh, the Shadow Legion's troops each have their own unique skills. Peace shields will not protect you from the Shadow Legion's troops. Every five waves, the Shadow Legions will dispatch elite troops. Defeat them for a chance to earn additional points. So, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So, you'll get... Five of those special ones, it looks like. It says rewards. You can unlock new reward tiers by reaching certain individual and alliance points milestones. You will only receive the highest tier of rewards you have unlocked. So it's not a cumulative, it's just the highest one. It makes sense. Uh, rewards will be sent by mail after the event ends. So not after we're done, after the event ends for the whole kingdom, I'm pretty sure. Important note, uh, teleporting your city while in the event, or excuse me, while the event is active will cost, will count as one breach. So don't move at all. If you leave the alliance during the event, your individual points will be reset to zero. So don't leave if you're trying to get some points. So let's go over some details okay so what you should be paying attention to and if you haven't been you should be number one make sure you're upgrading your towers here now my towers on this particular account this is my baby account um it's fairly decent uh, for what i'm at so i'm at wall eight so this should be getting upgraded okay you should upgrade this bad boy you should upgrade that bad boy but I'm still working on my level 8 here. And then I got all my stuff running. Uh, but level 9 actually. So I don't have time to do it. Now let's get into the garrison and the wall. So you got garrison commanders. So you should make sure. I don't really have really good commanders at the current moment. So it really doesn't matter in my uh, specific situation. But currently um, I don't have enough slots. You have to be obviously... Um, the higher you get up in your wall, the more you can put in. So as you can see, 10, 15, 20, 25, those particular ones are the uh, orders of which the those guys come out. So, you know, make sure if you have a level 15, make sure you're, you're getting this up here. You know what I mean? That, that would just make sense. Now, as far as commanders go... Um, what you can do is you can come up here where it says recommended. Um, you can put recommended here and then you just tap on garrison and it shows you your garrison commanders. So this particular garrison commander, if they're not in your lineup currently, since I have, do have a rally going on. Wait, did I send my other stuff to the rally? I think I did. Um, so once you have that set up, you want to make sure you're upgrading your garrison heroes because your garrison heroes are very important. I just, this is my brand new account. This is my baby account. I haven't really done anything with it yet, but I will be getting that going on. Uh, some of the other things too as well. Wait, did I already do that here? Uh, let me check something. I did not do the my keys yet, I don't think. Because I don't have the heroes that I normally would have. I don't think I did the promo code yet. Uh, so there is a, a, a bunch of promo codes here. Hold on a sec. Alright, so here's some of the promo codes that I've gotten so far. Um, what I know is some of the ones that start with X... These ones right here, um, some of them work and some of them don't. I think they're exclusive, and once they're out, they're out. But the the recap one, uh, the, these ones that are right here, these should be um, good here. So hold on, let me copy. Let's get back into the game and see if I've already used it already. 
So what you do is you go come into here, you go to redeem. I think yeah, I think I've already done it on this one. I think I've already done it on this account. Hold on. Because I do already have them on the dashboard. Let's see. Does that one work? So that's expired. Let's see. Let's see. Roxanne, Roxanne. I know these are the ones that were... So I've already used it on this account. So I got to use it on my other account. But those particularly is what you do want to do to upgrade your heroes. So make sure that you're doing that on your commanders especially. If you need that list, I will send it out to you. Make sure that you uh, ask for it. Um, I'm also going to put it on my Patreon. <laughs> if you have it already. Um, so if you haven't already subscribed to it, it's free. There is a paid option if you want to get into my uh, mastermind group. And it's only $5 a month, but it, it's going to be great because then you'll get all the latest updates and all the videos that I don't show. I make tons of videos for myself, um, for for just personal, because I do. And then I pick the ones that are going to be basic anyway, because I don't like to give everybody the information. Um, I'm just naturally like that. But at the end of the day, if you want more info, hit me up at that Patreon. I'll leave the description down below. Also, we have a group for... Um, we have a, a Discord channel, if you haven't already taken a look, you can go and take a look there too as well. It's called We Got Game, it's going to be under the um, ROK uh, tab, I believe, hold on a sec. So if you don't have Discord, you want to sign up here, go to Discord, and then you'll be able to uh, log in and then type in, in your search area, We Got Game, W-E. G-O-T-G-A-M-E. We got game. Let's do this. Uh, so, I will recap, because I like to recap to make sure we're on the same page and what we's talking about, player. We are talking about the Shadow Legion Evasion, which is going to be in about nine hours. And also keep in mind, we got the Mightiest Governor coming up pretty soon. So it's going to start at reset. So we got eight hours. description below <laughs> buy me a coffee daddy needs some drink drink you know what i mean anyway we got the mightiest governor coming up too as well so make sure you are paying attention to that and i will show you something really cool one sec this is the patreon group like i was telling you um it's brand new um however it will um you're able to join for free doesn't charge you just sign up with your Apple ID or your Google or your Facebook um, and on that note it does give you the info here as far as how this works like your points and um, the event um, so each all the stages your first stage is going to be the training of troops and then you have your barbarian fort, or barbarians basically, the levels of points. Then you have your gathering. Then you got your power up. Then you got your final sprint. And then you got the kill event. Uh, um, this right here. Six years, we've been building kingdoms, battling wars, Oop, and forging right friendships. Year after year, our commanders grow wiser, our troops... Yeah, we do. We grow wiser. I put the wrong information there. Um, there is a video. Um, who is it? 
I think it's Drisco. Uh, Drisco is somebody I watch. Cisco is somebody I watch. Uh, he really breaks it down. A lot of his stuff is in the newer area. Um, so I got to go back to the old stuff. You got to go into his archive stuff because he has over 2,000 videos of how to play. However, I'm just making this videos for the uh, our alliance. Not to mention, hey, get some coverage. You know, take a little bit of shine off of it. Some people are brand new too as well and they're starting in. Now, for those folks who are brand new, who have not played this before, and don't want to jump, we are in three, uh, excuse me, at yeah, 360, 42, uh, 36, 42. Let's get back into the, let's get back into our, uh, if you want to get into our, uh, uh, our area here, we're in 36, 42. We are part of the Greek gods. Come and join us. We would love to have you, especially this is for training. Um, this is for training events and training troops and training alliance. Uh, I will be working on diplomacy in our area, in our map, and I'll break it down as we go uh, with the flags and everything. And I can't stress this enough any more than I've already stressed it. Make sure you're doing the fog. It's all free stuff, people. Super simple. And what I like to do is I like to hit the outside. I like to hit. I like to hit the outside. You know what I'm saying? You gotta hit the. You gotta work the middle, but then you also gotta bend to the outside. All right. So I believe I've beat the dead horse to death, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like button, the subscribe button down there. Uh, sign up for the free Patreon, and if you do have Discord, hit me up at We Got Game if you have any questions or concerns or comments on what we can do better here at Hive Burners Gaming. This is K Boss, and I'm out.